and I love making smoothies in um, my juicer. Bananas are my go-to fruit. Um, those are, they're a fiber that are easy for anyone with digestive issues to eat. And then peaches, another thing, peaches, and then blueberries, all, they don't have seeds in them um, and they're easy to digest. together. Um, so it happened, uh, started back in July 2014. Um, I started getting stomach pain, didn't know what it was causing it, and I was taking, you know, ibuprofen, all that stuff to try to mask. I ended up going to my doctor. He ended up testing me for celiac disease. It tested positive, so he said to go gluten-free immediately. I did that. A couple months later, I had been gluten-free and was in worse pain than ever. They diagnosed me with ulcerative colitis and actually not having celiac disease, even though I do have a gluten intolerance, so I can't eat gluten. And they put me on meds right after that for my ulcerative colitis. I spent hours and hours in Facebook groups um, that have thousands of people just chatting about you see Crohn's, celiac. Between going gluten-free and the medicine that they had given me, I finally started to see some progress. So learning how to eat organically um, and gluten-free foods are definitely a challenge. But after I would say about six months, um, the, the urges finally do go away. It is definitely hard, um, but once you get there, um, I guarantee you'll feel much better. Um, so my fridge has got um, lactose-free yogurt, which I mix with uh, L-glutamine powder, powder and uh, chia seeds. Almond milk is what I drink now, um, I use on gluten-free cereal. Uh, peanut butter and jelly sandwich, as long as you got gluten-free bread and um, you can easily get organic peanut butter and organic jelly. When I was at my lowest, I wasn't exercising because I was I was too tired. Uh, now I've gotten back into exercising. I'm lifting weights. Um, you know, I do push-ups, sit-ups, the whole regimen now. Um, um, so definitely, exercise is a big one, and it will help you feel better. I would say the biggest thing is, if you're at your lowest point, get on the meds right away and go gluten-free. That's the combo that really seems to help most people. Thank you.